She lives in a beautiful waterfront home on Lake Washington, yet she is on welfare assistance. Now, federal agents have moved in to put a stop to it. Chris Ingalls has the exclusive story of this fraud case that raises a lot of questions, Chris. Yeah, Lori Dennis, question number one is why is the government sending a $1,200 a month housing voucher to a woman who lives in a million dollar plus home? In her application for benefits, the woman was truthful about her address, a gorgeous Lake Washington home that agents raided yesterday. Not the place where you would expect to find a down on her luck welfare recipient. But newly unsealed court documents say a woman who receives state and federal welfare payments has been living on this waterfront property since 2003. Property records show the 2,400 square foot home with gardens and big view windows is valued at $1.2 million. No one answered the door when King Five came knocking today. Next door neighbor Carl Tomei describes the couple that lives in the home as friendly and was surprised to hear they could be welfare cheats. Well, it's uh, shocking. I have I had no inkling that uh, this was going on. Agents believe the woman lived in the house with her chiropractor husband, who they suspect posed as a landlord renting her the house when she applied for benefits. The woman receives each month a voucher for $1,272 to pay her rent. On top of that, she gets federal and state cash payments for a disability and even a monthly allotment of food stamps. More about the couple. Records show they're contributors to charities. He drives a Jag, and they both travel around the world to exotic places. And they do it in part with your money, according to agents. We're not naming either of these people because they haven't been charged yet, although that is expected to happen in the near future. Now, Chris, do we know why this went on for, what, eight years, mm -hmm. yeah. and no one knew that this was a really ritzy address? Yeah, so I spoke with a federal official late today uh, about that, and he says the housing voucher program is designed to get people out of housing projects and get, get them money so they can live in a place that they're choosing, a good thing. The flaw, this official admits, is the program doesn't analyze where they're living, even if it's a, even if it's a plush address that should mm -hmm. raise a red flag. Interesting. All right, Chris, more on this later, I yeah. hope. Thank you, Chris.